TNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. On this Friday, the 13th of January, we're looking at for the Tiger Financial News Network 10 a.m. market update. Dow had been over 200 points down. Now it's down just 36 points at 34,153. Made that leg D. That's the objective in the chaff wave methodology uh, to try to get you from a buy signal to a buy mode, which says you should go to at least a D. D's where other things can happen. I do not like D's that fail underneath the previous high. But when you're coming off lows, that's that's one thing. So we're going to be watching this closely. Uh, a nice comeback here. And the weekly chart says we're stuck in a range for now. We're looking at uh, key support at least today at the 34,000 level. If it takes that out, it says you could have a bit more of a consolidation after such a strong move up. S&P is almost the same thing. You had a leg D yesterday. It could turn out to be a peak D today. I always type that in the wrong place. Let me just put that back here. There we go. S&P is trading uh, down 16 at 39.65. Uh, uh, the 200 period moving average of 39.93. Uh, 30, uh, is strong. 93, yes, 93 is strong resistance. Probably going to make a peak B to peak D today, just underneath the previous high. That's yesterday's high. Stuck in this inside track repellent zone. We want to see it next week, trying to get to the 40, 40, 20 level or higher. That's what's going to be very important. The QQQ and the X100 trading down $1.23 at 277 uh, uh, also, leg D could possibly make a PD, and the IWM, which is only in leg C, was very strong yesterday. And even today is a nice green candle after the pullback, but it is down. It's down 51 cents at 185.35, right on the 200 period moving average. This is actually pretty good, good action for the IWM on a Friday with the weekly chart just sneaking out of the inside track repellents and looking at gold. Gold, on, as always, is going up for at least for quite a while now. It's up 12. At 1910, it's going into this left side. I'll talk about it when in my show coming up. The left side, right side price uh, target that was on the left side is only a leg C in the weekly chart, so that's still strong. But the daily is getting a little bit close to the uh, resistance area. We're looking at the dollar. Wow, dollar's trying to find some support it's up 24 ticks at 102.24. Crude oil was running earlier. Now it's up a little bit, up 50 cents in the lower range at 78. And the TLT bonds. Bonds are trading um, down 26 cents, so yields are coming down a little bit. I'll be back for the Tiger Technician's Hour. Have a wonderful long weekend. Check out my opening call, Daily News Tech.